As we know, affinity tags have greatly facilitated the detection and the purification of recombinant proteins. It is also important to remove these tags for various protein applications, especially for purification of therapeutic proteins. The most common tool used for tag removal is proteases. However, this tool is either non-specific, inefficient, or fairly expensive. Alternatively, intins, the self-splicing protein elements, have been engineered to undergo an N-terminal or C-terminal cleavage to be used as a self-cleaving tool for tag removal. The major problem is all these engineered intins still require at least overnight incubation and room temperature to achieve significant cleavage. As shown here, this is a conventional intim-mediated purification system in which the purification tag is fused to the end terminals of the intin N fragments that can be attached to the affinity resin. The protein of interest is fused to the C terminals of the intin C fragments. Upon specific intin association, stimulants can be added to induce C terminal cleavage to release the POI in the flow through. Previously in our lab, we have engineered NPU DNAE split intin to undergo such a C terminal cleavage by introducing a single mutation D11AG. This mutation generates fast C terminal cleavage with more than 80% completion in three hours and room temperature. In this study, we further engineered the purification system named SIRP by repositioning the tag and the intin N split junction. This strategic repositioning generates ultra-rapid C-terminal cleavage with more than 90% completion in just 30 minutes. As shown in this cartoon, we reason that positioning tag and the split junction eliminates the steric hindrance that affects the critical intin association and activity. Thus, we increase the cleavage activity significantly. This diagram shows the purification strategy using SIRP. Here, CSTAR represents the intin C fragments with D11AG mutation for enhanced C terminal cleavage, and the NC1A represents the intin N fragments with the C1A mutation that is commonly used to eliminate N terminal cleavage. In the first step, the cell lysates containing the NC1A CBD fusion is loaded on the chitin column. After wash, the cell lysates containing the C-star fusion is loaded for specific intin association. And this is done in presence of zinc. We introduce the zinc irons here as an effective inhibitor for C-terminal cleavage, since we observe that even without inducer DTT, the cleavage can happen, which is not preferred for the binding and the washing. After thorough washing, DTT can be added to induce C-terminal cleavage to allow connecting of the POI in the flow through. Using this strategy, we purified proteins of various sizes and quaternary structures in just 30 minutes. This SDS page shows the sample purification of a model enzyme PTDH. As shown here, the cleaved PTDH can be retrieved in the flow through with high purity. As shown in this SDS page gels, we can recycle the resin bound NC1A CBD for at least four times. Importantly, the purity and yield of the purified PTDH can be maintained constant over four times. And last but not least, we also demonstrated the cleavage efficiency is not affected by plus one residue, which is also the first residue of your target protein. The wild type intin proteins contains a cysteine residue at the plus one position. We thus mutated this cysteine to the other 19 amino acids, as shown here. Most of these residues do not affect the cleavage efficiency with more than 80% completion in just 30 minutes. Only a few of them reduced the cleavage efficiency, but essentially only threonine showed significantly reduced cleavage efficiency and only proline abolished the activity completely. Thus, we can conclude that 
target proteins with any N-terminal residues can be cleaved efficiently, thus we enabled complete removal of purification tags. Also shown in this table, the right parts, all this cleavage can be effectively inhibited by zinc irons for controllable cleavage. In a summary, our SIRP technology facilitates ultra-rapid purification of tagless recombinant proteins in less than one hour. This system enables controllable and complete tag removal and also allows regeneration of intim n beta fragments for multiple usage. Overall, ICRP should provide a useful tool for large-scale purification of tagless proteins and peptides.